Let me just share a quick story with you. So my daughters, like many young people today, are huge fans of Beyonce. In fact, because of them, there is hardly any Beyonce song, which I don't know. Anytime she releases a new album, it's like Christmas Day in our family. So you can imagine the excitement last week when she actually released, or as they would say, when she actually dropped a new album. Screams galore. But I was even more surprised when I looked at the musical artists featured on the album. Tiwa Savage, Wizkid, Burna Boy, Yemi Alade, Shatawale, among others. Our own homegrown African talent. Our own homegrown African talent sharing the stage with the biggest pop star in the world. It is an amazing testament to the immense potential of African entrepreneurs individually and as a collective. With the right push, the right resources, and the right environment, you, our entrepreneurs, can compete on the world stage. And this excellence cuts across all sectors in agriculture, in ICT, in fashion, in healthcare, really across all sectors. This reinforces our belief at the Tony Alumelu Foundation that there are hidden gems in Africa who with the right amount of support, training, and seed capital can be global trailblazers in their chosen fields. Young Africans, there is excellence in you. You owe it to yourselves, therefore, your families, your communities, and the Africa and the world in general, to put in the hard work, to build the resilience, and to keep at it until you succeed. The world awaits you.